Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to give you guys a close, in-depth look at the brand new Fall Winter 19 Supreme shoulder bag. I'm also give you guys a size comparison to the other bags, see if we can fit in it, and we're going to finish off with an on-body shot. Let's get straight into it. Alright guys, so I'm back at my studio to give you guys a closer look at the brand new Supreme Fall Winter 19 shoulder bag. Now before we start off with the bag, I'm going to give you guys some background information. So this bag retailed for a price of 48 US dollars, which is honestly not that bad for what this is. Now compared to the past two shoulder bags that we've seen from Supreme, this one is a lot smaller, but those retailed for $88 and this is almost half of what they were going for. Also, in my opinion, the pricing isn't all that bad. As you can see, it has the in-store tag right here and I can verify that the retail is indeed 48 US dollars. Now this bag comes in four different colorways. Now in front of me right here, I have the black variant and the black and the camel variants are probably the two most popular colorways of the four that are dropping this season. Honestly, I'm not a big fan of the other two colorways of the bags because I kind of think they look funky and cheap, but the black and camel colorways definitely do look very nice. Now I also have a couple of the past season bags to compare to you guys to give you guys a good estimate of how big this bag is. So right here we have the Supreme Utility Pouch from last season. Now if you guys want to check out the review I did on this bag right here, I'll leave a um, link down in the description um, as well as a photo here. Um, basically this is the bag that we released last season. Now this bag right here, the new shoulder bag, is indeed a lot bigger compared to the Utility Pouch. Um, it does not look that way on the screen right now, but I will give you guys an in-depth look. Now this one retails for $40, so which is $8 cheaper than this. Now of course I also do have the brand new Supreme wallet or small zip pouch that released as part of Fall Winter 19 as well. And I will have a separate video for the review of this bag right here so stay tuned for that. But yeah that's the new Supreme shoulder bag side by side to two previous um, bags we've seen. This one is a lot bigger than these two. Now these two look very similar in size but once you actually get into the pockets you'll find out that this one's actually a lot bigger than this one right here. It also fits a lot more. So that's it for the size comparison between the other bags. Now let's jump into the actual bag itself. The bag is approximately five inches wide and about eight inches tall. So you should be able to fit any smartphone in here, whether that be an iPhone XS Max or the new Samsung Galaxy Note 10. All big phones should be able to fit um, with ease in this bag right here. Now, as you can see, I got this bag in store um, a couple days before the online release. And that is why we have the in-store tag as well as the quarter tag. Now, if you buy this bag online, it should come in a plastic bag and you'll only be getting this tag. So just because it doesn't have that tag does not mean it's fake. Um, so here's the bag, a 360 overview of the bag. I'll put the brightness up so it's easier for you guys to see. Um, as you can see, it consists of three main pockets. So we have this one right here, which has a Velcro pocket. And then we have two zip pouches, the smaller one on the front and the main compartment on the top. Now on the back, we have a carabiner hook, so you can hook it onto anything if you don't want to use it with the included strap, which I'll get to in just a second. So yeah, if you want to hook this onto your backpack when you're going hiking or any, kind, any of that kind of stuff, there is a hook. Now back here, this is not a pocket. Um, I don't know if you guys see that there's like a lining. That is not a pocket, but there are two hooks, um, and these hooks will grab onto the included strap, which I'll get to in just a second. Now I'm going to go over, go over the different um, pocket sizes of this bag and tell you guys what you can fit, what you can't fit. So first off, we have the main compartment, which is a Velcro pocket. This pocket is pretty small and you probably won't be able to fit a phone in here. Now you could probably put, um, put like a pack of gum or like a credit card. So if you're going around like an amusement park or whatever, you could probably put a card in here. But honestly, this pocket isn't that big and it's also not well protected. So I don't really recommend keeping anything in here, but it does look nice. Of course, on that pocket, we have the Supreme logo um, embroidered on there. Um, it's very nice. It's like a little patch and they kind of embroidered it on. Next up, we do have another pocket up here. Um, this one is a lot deeper than the first pocket and it is a little bigger too. So I do have an example phone for you guys and this will fit with ease um, in that pocket. If you have a bigger phone, like I said, like the iPhone XS Max or the Samsung Galaxy Note 10, this won't um, fit the phone because there's only a little bit of room and this is a pretty small phone. Uh, it's a Galaxy S7 if you're wondering. So you really won't be able to fit anything too big in here, but anything like your wallet should fit with ease. 
Now, um, that's it for the second compartment. Now we're just gonna move on to the biggest compartment up here. This is the main compartment. It's probably where you're all you're gonna stuff all your goods. Now, like I said earlier, there is an included strap for this bag. So how this works is there are two hooks and these two hooks go on to the back two hooks of the bag and it provides a strap so you could use it as a shoulder bag instead of clipping it onto a separate bag which is very nice um i'll show you guys how that strap works and how it looks in my on body portion at the end of this video but going back into the pocket itself as you can see it is one giant compartment and it's very big my entire hand fits in it now some of you may be wondering how it compares to the supreme utility pouch so i'm about to show you guys right now so you can see this utility pouch um it's very thin the pocket is very thin and i really can't stuff all my hand in it just stick my four fingers in it so that's how small it is um whereas this one right here the pocket's actually very big it's also a lot thicker so you'll be able to carry a lot more stuff and your entire hand fits in it um so that's nice now of course this is probably where you're going to put your uh more essentials so your phone obviously will fit in here even a bigger phone will have no problem fitting in this pocket now if you have something like a power bank that's also very good for putting in this compartment though depending on your power bank you may have a harder time putting it in um most, most power banks honestly won't have a problem now on the inside main compartment there's actually a secondary zip zipper pocket um which i'll put the brightness up once again so you guys can see that so there is a separate zipper pocket um there's nothing in that pocket and i'm pretty sure the pocket is very small it doesn't really go that it does go pretty deep but it doesn't go that deep and um you can't really put stuff in it i guess you could put your cables or whatever honestly not that useful but the main compartment is very big all right so before we jump off to the on body portion of this video i just want to give you guys my final verdict on this bag is it worth it or is it not honestly i do like the other shoulder bags better especially the one from ss18 but for the price of only 48 us dollars i'm honestly not really complaining this is a lot more functional than last season's supreme utility pouch and for only eight dollars more i would pick this one over this one any day just because it has way bigger pockets um look wise it doesn't really look that nice especially um considering the fact that when you put the straps on they don't actually go on the end they go um towards a little bit towards the center so the strap will come off here and it looks kind of weird um but if you could get over that which i think everyone should be able to because it's really not that big of a deal this is a great bag it's very functional you could put your essentials your battery wallet phone any of that kind of stuff in this bag and you will have no problem fitting all those um and like i said for the price of 48 dollars this really isn't that bad of a deal now if you guys want i'll leave a link in the description to where you guys can cop this safely for um, resale if you guys want to cop this for retail you're going to have to be on supremenewyork.com um this item itself is releasing part of supreme week one however you can expect there to be some minor restocks throughout the season especially if you're going in store so i do recommend that you guys keep an eye out for that but that's it for the review of this bag now let's jump on to the on body portion